Hello folks, good afternoon, Earthmaster here, jumping in with a quick update video on this uh, pretty large earthquake striking around the Philippines Islands area. You can see on the globe there, 6.7 magnitude main shaker there in the uh, larger ring, followed up by a 5.8 aftershock. Let's go ahead and check out uh, what's going on over there in the Philippines area. Once again, pretty, uh, pretty good size earthquake. See if I can get this pulled up here, right? I got to get this. There we go. All righty. Latest from the USGS map as we zoom into the Philippines area, 6.7. Originally a 6.4 on the EMSC website, but uh, upgraded by the USGS to a 6.7. And last time I just checked here, just actually I just checked a couple minutes ago on the tsunami threat. There was none. And you can see there is no tsunami warning advisory, watch or threat from this pretty large earthquake around the Philippines area. Uh, due to the magnitude uh, and the depth of this earthquake, which is at 65 kilometers below the surface. Uh, but just checking out real quick here. You can see uh, the notice put out, there is no tsunami threat from this earthquake. Once again, 6.7 earthquake striking the region of the Philippines area, just southwest of Manila. Uh, no doubt quite a few folks uh, reported feeling that earthquake in the region. Uh, I can see there are uh, numerous, numerous areas as far as the shake map goes from this earthquake. Um, there's some user reports up around the Manila area. Epicenter is going to be the star. So pretty much all over the south area and uh, just into this region as well. Uh, that earthquake, like I said, was followed up by a 5.8. The 6.7 struck at about 112 kilometers below the surface, 5.8, 132 kilometers below the surface, but generally within that same area of the uh, main shake. But still, that's some pretty deep movement for this region uh, after a pretty, uh, pretty decent quiet spell in this region over the last couple days here. You can see uh, not too much movement up here along the Pacific plates into Japan. Uh, even Taiwan's gone pretty quiet, but now it looks like things have changed. Uh, with this pretty good size earthquake and that is showing up uh, pretty nicely on quite a few seismograph stations that I do have pulled up um, including down there in Southern California uh, picking up the uh, P waves from that earthquake but watch for more potential aftershock activity no doubt from this uh, larger magnitude there's some of the P waves being kicked up uh, there in Southern California from that 6.7, which uh, will probably ring the ring the bell a little bit, uh, the earth bell that is, for a tad bit, since some uh, vibrational frequencies throughout the land uh, and might stir things up. Who knows, we'll have to keep an eye on this. So we'll be back a little bit later, folks, uh, with a more complete update for now, 6.7 earthquake striking the Philippines area just a short time ago, followed up by a 5.8 aftershock, no tsunami threat, advisory watch or warning uh, from this earthquake. 